<laughs> uh, right, so I actually went to the store during the break, because I live not far from one. And while in the store, I heard somebody articulate exactly what's going on in Helsinki right now. They said, Helsinki is wet. You may notice I'm wearing a different shirt. Uh, <laughs> but it's an appropriate shirt, given today's happenings. Right. So let's see here. What am I doing now? What was I doing? Beats me. I don't have that long of a memory. I think I'm done with these dev null things. I'm kind of... Excuse me. I'm tired of messing with them. Because it's hard to predict exactly what they're going to do. Is the dev null stack? No, it is not. Right. Hello, chat! I am, again, and still, sitting in the TeamSpeak for Forgecraft. This is assuming that the TeamSpeak will remain up, because it's gone down two or three times over the course of my this evening's stream. Alright. Still haven't seen Asinor in order to ask him about why this doesn't work. But yeah. Alright, so we've cleared out this area. Now we're going to build Well this thing. Here. So I need some arcane stone blocks. Which are any shard and stone. Make a bunch of those. Some altars. Or pedestals, sorry. Alright, so. Arcane stone blocks. I need actual baked stone for that, don't I? Yeah. Has to be actual stone, not cobble. So... I think I have a very little bit of that, but it's easier just to go to the workshop and make some from there. Are there still... Yeah, I've not logged out and logged back in. I should have done that over the break. Um, oh well. Uh, the purple particles are apparently... Uh, Cuts was playing earlier with different morphs, uh, and one of those morphs he has is some kind of taint swarm, because he's killed a taint swarm. So... He morphed into that, and then the swarm particle stuck around after he morphed back out. So, he left swarm particles in my base. Alright, let's get some baked stone. There's not in here. Oh! Strange whispers have revealed secrets to me. They told me something about Perdicio. Okay, there's a whole bunch of sand in here. Because I've been telling it to do sand. This cave is going to run in here. I, I threw some stuff in the round. Just to make sure there's supplies of things. Don't know that people want that much. Baked stone. Thing of stone. Okay, that's easy. Does Soren always try to kill you? Most of the time. Okay. Now. And then I need some shards. I 
I have shards. Quite a few shards. And I seem to live in an area that produces earth shards frequently. Alright. I now have arcane stone blocks. Actually, I already had some arcane stone blocks, now that I think about it, but oh well. Have I scanned arcane stone blocks? Good, I have. Uh, that's pedestals. And I'll need one for the middle, and then... Uh, at least four around, but it gets up to much higher. So I'll probably want a total of seven at some point. Uh, so I guess I'll go ahead and make eight. Oops. Eight! All right, and now I need to make this thingy, Ender Pearl, which I have a bunch of, because I have an Ender Pearl farm. Uh, any shards, but it has to be four of the same one. And then four arcane stone blocks. So, easy peasy. Um, just looking for an ender pearl. Pearl. And now four of the same shard. I'm probably going to use the earth shards, because again, I seem to be getting a bunch of them. Insufficient viz. Well, darn it. I'll have to go recharge then. Uh, let's go ahead and clear out some of the things in my inventory. Add it. Uh, before I make that, I guess I'll finish off some of the rest of the construct. So the actual construct is kind of... You actually build the blocks in place. Uh, so I put down a pedestal. I'll need some stone bricks. Arcane stone bricks, specifically. Uh, so those are pretty easy. Can I just do them in here? Yes. Good. I didn't want to have to take all the stuff out of there. All right. So this is the middle of the room. here. So then these things go there, 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 and there. And then that goes there, there. Whoops. Okay. I'm going to leave that there for now because I can place the thing against it in a bit. Uh, I'll need to put one of these here. And then I've been told that balance is a key thing in this, so designing this balanced is an important idea. Um, Okay, I'm now done with these things. Okay. Put that away. Put that away. Let's go charge my wand. Easiest place to do that is at Kent's place, because he has the uh, recharge. My volume's kind of loud, I think. Alright. 
right. Throw down the wand. You can actually see it charging. How am I able to fly and move faster? I have bubbles. There is an angel wing. Angel ring. Sorry. Invisible wings. And the Sojourner's Sash, which is from Botania. Both of these were given to me. I don't actually know how to make either one. I mean, I can look at the recipes. So, that's how you do that, I guess. Alright, fully charged, ready to go. Alright. Back over here. Uh, let's finish crafting this. I now have a runic matrix. I'm gonna need that wand. Or activate this thing. Alright. Okay, so this should, no, how did I turn it on? Okay, everything's in place. in the right places. Um, you can click on the runic matrix with a wand. I guess, yeah, I don't have the appropriate aspects in my wand. So what all was necessary in order to... Whoa, yeah, 25 of everything. This wand is presently mostly drained. So I'm going to have to charge it again just to do this. I thought there'd be enough. I was wrong. While we're here, let's see if we can find... Uh the local infusion system chamber thing. Oh, he's got one. Got a. Oh, okay. His is just inside here. Uh, so it's a seven by seven area. Uh, it's one away here. Somebody in chat was saying, does it need to be one away? I don't know. Da, da, da. Several more altars uh, placed around, or more pedestals placed around the altar where you can place the blocks and items you wish to infuse. So it doesn't actually say how far away they need to be. I think that that close is fine, but I can't space it out. Uh, that wand has a slightly smaller vis cost. It reduces it slightly. It's like 95% or something like that. Because it's got gold caps. It's a good wand. It's not an excellent wand, but it's a good wand. It could stand to be much bigger. I really wish I didn't have to charge it so much. But in order to make a bigger one, I need this thing. The thing that I'm making. So. 
Boom. I didn't scan this. I should scan this. Nothing to be learned from the infusion pillar. Apparently. Okay. Uh, I can space these out. It's not a big deal, but it may make it a little easier to work on, so... Okay... Um, I don't know if the stuff, like the ground, matters. This is one of those things where it's apparent it's really temperamental and you don't really understand the mechanics for it and it's please be okay. Um but yeah. Okay. Now, this is kind of a high level one already. It, it's a little hard to make. Um, I should probably make some of the lower level stuff first so I'm a bit more uh, set for things. But this is kind of the target. Uh, fire shards. Do I even have fire shards? No! Well, I guess that makes that kind of a moot thing, doesn't it? I can't even do that. I need fire shards. Hmm. I think a desert would be a uh, place to look for fire shards. Fortunately, Digger is a desert. Go digging around there and look. Let's see here. There are no deserts that I can find. Right. I know of no deserts. Suggest so making robes. It's probably a good idea. What map am I using? This is Journey something? Journey map, in fact. I think. Uh, robes are a good idea. Somebody suggested I make robes. Uh, I'm fairly certain that's just fabric in the uh, thing. And then using the fabric to make boots and leggings and the actual robes. And that's a great idea. Guess I'll do that. So, let's see, I have some string, I don't have enough string in order to do this, really. Oops. Because you only get one, and I need a whole bunch. So, good idea, gonna require I have something that uh, I can get more string from. Clearly, this is the cotton to grow. You can take two cotton and craft two cotton. I don't think I understand the point. that I thought I did, but it's still only a bit more strength. 
So I'm gonna need string. I just put all the string there. Okay. That's really just supposed to be a to-do list and not a storage container, so. real quick. Lag. Yep. I almost managed to do that without touching them. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna make multiple mods caught in the same, but it only worked for her, like for that one. It only worked for that one cotton. I mean, it's probably using the ore dictionary, but this isn't. found cotton. I want to get into all the uh, farming stuff here. There's a lot of fun things you can do with a lot of those, but I need some space first. Uh, I'm fairly certain they're all grown and they're all berries in there, but he's not doing nothing, so I'll do it. Boom, 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 boom. There's a lot of these. Which is good. That was an interesting sound. I don't know if you could hear that, but I'm fairly certain lightning just struck somewhere near here. Some of the berries. All right. Use the cotton in the chest to make string. Oh, that's an option. Still only make ten string, or eleven. Still not nearly enough. Fire shards. Let's uh get a bit better prepared first then. I should make uh better tools. And since I think the running opinion is I should make things using the Tinker's Construct stuff, I'll run over to uh, there and see. Don't need 
that. It's for lighting up here and things around here. Take that with me because I might use that. Um, see if there's any fire sharks at Sora's base. That's actually. I guess it wouldn't matter too much. I'm not sure if they're going to use any fire shards. I don't think they're doing any Thumbcraft. What was that? I have some fire sharks. So let's whoosh over to uh, fireballs, tools, since he has the structure stuff for baking stuff. Alright, so there's this tool forge thing. Cross tie thingy. One wooden binding. And actually, can I? And then a pickaxe head. Can't do that that way, apparently. I think Tinker's Construct requires you to uh, forge the metals. So... Let's figure out here. Yeah, here's a pickaxe head. Cast? Yeah. Cost of one. So I guess that's just one bar. I wouldn't mind help. <laughs> I don't know Tinker's Construct. Much established at this point. Um, there's a zombie. It seems quite lost. I think it's going for villagers. <laughs> That's comical. He's a hardy zombie. Hello. Welcome back. Doctor Who was good. I shall say nothing more. Thank you. Uh, don't spoil it for me, thank you. No, I have no intention of. Stone or netherrack for the binding, not wood. Netherrack is better than stone, to be specific. Mm, what netherrack are you tool. building? A pickaxe, using Tinker's Construct. I would use paper for a binding. Paper for a binding? You get an extra modifier. The, the binding has no effect on the durability of the tool. It only gives material properties. And I would use blue slime for the handle. That gives the highest multiplier for durability short of uh, manulin. And you get the extra modifier from the paper binding. Uh, the handle modifier is 0.3 on paper binding. I, I yeah, don't... yeah, but the binding is not the handle, the handle is the main. The handle does a multiplier, the head does the base value in the digging, and the binding provides material properties only. Okay. So, paper binding. And then what for the handle? Uh, blue slime. Blue slime for the handle? Yeah. 
Whoa! What on earth was that? Lightning! Wow! It must be striking in the that, area. That sounded very close. Yes! Yeah. Okay! So, you know, if I suddenly vanish, you all know what happened. I got struck by lightning. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well I have some blue slime, but it's back home, so I'm gonna finish... You need four of them. You'll be able to make two rods from it, though. Okay. Yeah, the uh, the only thing that's better than blue slime is manulin itself, which is kind of a, you know, <laughs> given how uh, relatively uncommon it is, especially with everybody having gone through the nether picking this stuff out, um, it's probably better to save that for the heads of tools, especially the heavy ones. What were you saying it's, is better? Uh, manulin is the only thing better than blue slime for handle. Okay. But because of the cost of doing that, and it's relative... Uh, scarcity. It's still probably better to use the blue slime. Got it. Hexcomp confirmed as Thor. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to watch Doctor Who later. That's what I'm going to do. Since Doctor Who's not showing right now in Finland. Not fair. Uh, but I'm going to go back to my place swiftly. Exceedingly swiftly, given I just covered a huge amount of distance in a very short span of time because of the brokenness of miscraft linking books. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I bother doing that. Um. Slime. The other thing is with the repair stuff, you can make the uh, self-repair moss from mossy cobble brick, which you can chisel from smooth stone or other brick. So that's also incredibly easy to get as well. So you mean gelatinous slime? Uh, I do not know. <laughs> what does it's it look blue. like? blue. It's slime. Is it the, the slime block from the island? It's, uh, I have three of the balls. I can get the, yes. uh... Yeah, that stuff. Yeah, sorry, I, I was waiting for the stream to catch up. I didn't know its exact name. Yeah. Um, I have three. Apparently I need four? Yeah, you need four, because that makes one, like, um, slime dirt stuff you cook to make a crystal. And that's the thing that is worth one material. Okay, so... I think I've got a spare one. Ah, good. I grew, uh, Lyra, a great wood tree. Alright, where was this? I know there was an island over here. There it is! This is where I got my trees. I thought you were gonna go over there and um, you'll be in the middle of a windmill or something. But then I remember that's something Sauron would do. Middle of a windmill? Yeah, the foundation's gonna be a windmill. The one, the round part. When you said about growing the tree, I thought for a moment when you went that way, it was going to be in the middle of the foundation. Oh. Okay. I now have six. Seems that uh, it's constantly spawning slimes over here, but they largely seem to drown. Yeah, it looks like an un unusually deep pool. They're normally only one or two blocks deep at most. Usually <laughs> deep pool, plus it's got a tree in it. Yeah, so we get stuck what? under the tree and drown. It's like, okay. Alright, back to the ground. Back home. How are you flying? I have uh, angel wings from 
Was it extra utilities or open blocks? Extra utilities. Both kind of these uh, miscellaneous useful utility mods, so I have some difficulty telling which one's which sometimes. Uh, I suggest that I get a diamond for the actual pig head. That would be recommended, I suppose. It would if you're making it out of iron, yeah. Hmm? It would if you're making the head out of iron, which it looked like you were. Yeah, I'm making a head, of, head out of iron. Uh, what's the value for... Like, what would I use... How would I use the diamond? As a modifier. It uh, would increase... It would give a flat increase to the durability and raise its dig level to diamond. Okay. I'll have to figure out... You'll have to explain to me how to do that. Uh, With this, right. you have four modifier slots. Yeah. Would have three, but you get one with a paper binding. That would be used one, so three left. At least one for a repair. And then perhaps one for the fortune. I don't know. And one for whatever else. Alright, so... That didn't work. How am I supposed to use this gel? Or the slime? Uh, you craft four of them together, plus one dirt, plus one sand, and then you cook the resulting block. Oh, okay. So... Craft four of them together, plus one dirt. And one sand. So do I actually put the... Uh, I craft them together, take the congealed blue slime, or no, you four, you, four, four gelatinous slimes, and one okay. dirt, and one sand in a crafting grid. I'll have to get a sand. Whoosh. Fortunately, I you have sure one couple. Hmm? Unfortunately, you have one cobble to grind. <laughs> no, I've made sure there's plenty of sand. Alright, so... Alright, slimy mud. Yummy. And I baked that to get a slime crystal. Yes. Alright, I'm not going to bake that here, because that goes straight into his system. So, I'll go back to the digger and do it. Foosh. Froda. Slime crystal. Probably wind up watching Doctor Who with friends. Oops. Because people are asking in chat. What are the uses of this slime crystal? I can't find out from here. It has no uses. It's useless! Alright. And now I have a slime shard. Yay. Okay, so double check this for me. I have a slime tool rod, an iron pickaxe head, and a paper binding. Yes, though, with the stuff you've got, how much aluminium do you have? Because you could make alumite instead, which is diamond level to begin with, and more durability. I have no aluminum. Damn. That is... Mm, yeah, iron's not great, but with the diamond thing it should be fine. It'll have relatively low durability, though, but... Uh, you still got the other slime rod, or the other bit of slime that you can make another rod out of for later. Yep. Yep, that would work. I'm just gonna steal a diamond from uh, 
fireball here. He'll never know. Unless he's listening. They can hear you. Ah, oh, you can hear me. He knows. Dun, 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 I'm a devil. I also have aluminum. Okay. Now I have a cooler pickaxe. Let's go to Nigger! <laughs> I used to be a Time Lord like you, but then I took a regeneration to the face. Right, it's downstairs. The answer is simply, Winslow, that I have no idea how I will wind up watching Doctor Who. Um, am I in a desert? I'm in a desert. Let's see if there's any fire shards around. These resources, and I just don't care. Nope. Doing that wrong. New or minor. I've had tin ore in my inventory before. Oh. But the thing is, was it industrial craft? I don't know. Arg. Stupid gravel. I hate gravel. <laughs> Another good one. I used to be a genius until I started making souffles. Right click with the Tinker's Construct tool to place a torch. Doesn't seem no, like. it's right click to place the block that's one slot to the right of it. Ah, that's not how I like to organize my inventory. Yeah, I have it as uh, <laughs> weapon torches pick, so it doesn't work for me either. Guess I should have grabbed a shovel too. Gravel. You know what? I don't need to dig it through the gravel. Just dig ah! around it. Yes. Wow. This was a good this turn. Is... Suddenly iron. For a moment I thought, hey, you should go dig it. Wait, no, no armor. That's a very bad idea. Yeah.
probably don't care too much about the iron, but... Yeah, but anyway. Alright, so what's my inventory look like? Kind of oddly crowded, but I can cure that. Why do I have my wand with me? I have more earth shards. Face. All right. I've not seen Doctor Who yet. I was streaming. Wenzel is insisting, for the love of pickles, that you help me with the modifiers. Well, you've already got one of them. Yeah, I got one. How many do I need? Well, there are four slots. If you put some repair on there, it'll just it'll auto heal itself. So you don't need to repair it. All right, that'd be good. Yeah. How do I do that? Well, uh, you need the moss ball stuff, which is made from. Uh, like mossy cobble or mossy stone brick, which you can make with a chisel, which is very exploity. Yeah, that's kind of exploity. <laughs> it's like really exploity, but yeah, um, and that. So I mean, on, on my pick, I have three levels of repair and one of fortune. But you've used one of your four modifiers with the diamond, which makes sense with the type of head you have. But mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I'd probably fill the other two with repair and then one with fortune. Okay, so let's make some uh, mossy cobble. Well, stone brick's easier because you can chisel it from uh, smooth stone. How do I do this? The have you used this chisel from chisel before? I've never used chisel. I have no idea how chisel works. Right. Okay. You need to make one of them. Need to make a chisel. Yeah. Okay. It's useful for later anyway, because they if you use it right, then they don't run out of durability anyway. The chisel from chisel. It's one iron and a yep. stick. Yep. I think I've even got that on me. Chisel! All right, right, yeah. Right. right click with that into the air. And then you can put stuff in to see what it would build to. And you need to do nine smooth stone to mossy stone brick for each set of repair you want. Okay. I just made a lot of mossy stone brick. That's okay. Um. <laughs> All right. So now I have a lot of mossy stone brick. Three by What's three the other that. one? Fortune. Uh, yeah, that's just lapis lazuli. Lapis lazuli. 
Yep. I can do that. Because I noted earlier that, uh... Where'd they go? Rain plant seeds. If you just stick them in a crafting table, they become lapis lazuli. I didn't ask how much lapis lazuli I need. Just one? Ha! <laughs> Not even close. To get the full effect of Fortune 3, you need 450. 450 lapis lazuli? Yeah, but the thing is, if you put even one on, it'll eventually build up over time. Because I put on like okay. 30, and it's only Fortune 2 at the moment, but, you know, that would still have been 300. I mean, right, really, so most of the time I use the one that I enchanted anyway. Instead, because so it would So if I put, like, 16 or something... You can put it on in blocks as well, if you want to do it faster. Because otherwise you have to do it one at a time. Okay. Do a multiple of nine then. Yeah. Where am I going? There. All right. So. First thing, this in here. Uh, the mossy stone brick doesn't do anything to the pickaxe. That's because you need to turn into moss balls by doing crafting three by three of it. To turn it into moss balls. Yeah, like three by three of the stone brick will get you a moss thing, and that's one modifier's worth. Okay. I want two of those. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright. And now that in there. Cool. Let's go back and do that. Clang, clang. Okay. Oh, now, auto repair. Cool. Yeah, definitely should have gotten the Tinker's construct to begin with. doing that. I'm supposed to go down first. Whoosh. Now that heals better when it's in the sun. Okay. Like a lot faster. The moss repairs much faster when it's in the sun. But it will repair at all times anyway. appear reasonably constantly then. Yeah, we, we will do it. it. It's kind of random intervals and, you know, mm -hmm. there's more chance that it'll happen when you're standing with the line to the sky. Okay. 
Yeah, I probably don't care too much for, but... Two different kinds of copper. Air. Still shards, but not the shards I was looking for. I wonder if Asnos fixed making balanced shards out of other things other than uh, air shards. Uh, it looked like it was fixed. I'm not before I was able to select it, and then it just would go back to the other recipe, wanting air shards instead. As such, I'm very low on air shards. Well, it looked like it was uh, fixed in the Thomonomicron. Well, no, it, it showed them all of the recipes as being there in the Thomonomicon, but it was in the Thaumatorium. It mm -hmm. would just, you'd select one, and then you'd look away from it and look back in the UI, and it would set back to the air one. Hmm. So I'm not, if, I'm not sure if it, uh, it deals properly with having multiple different recipes of the same thing. No, it seems like it did. Like there was something else that did that, but uh... also a couple of days ago, I wasn't able to make the hoodlums in there. I, I have been able to more recently, but it just wouldn't lock them. Hmm. Yeah, I think we need a thormium saw, a you know, multi-part one. That'd be fun, yeah. Because then you could put repair on it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be making a crowbar soon, I imagine. Actually, no, that was because of me thinking I could make the uh, uh, record farm using railcraft, but then decided against it. So maybe that's not such a great idea. And we've found the surface. Ha! Take that quicksand! Ha! Or you just fly out of it. Yes! <laughs> oh, I put away my scanner. I shouldn't have done that. Did you put it in the bag? No, it's back at home. I mean, you should put it in the bag. I should have put it in the bag, yes. You are indeed correct, sir. Uh, 